Hey guys, welcome back to Slow Travel Chronicles. My name is Stephanie and in this week's video I have six grocery hauls because I forgot to put them in earlier videos mixed in. But anyway, I like that type of content. I hope you do too. I also take you along as we go out to eat and show you what we have on Super Bowl Sunday. So let's go check out some food. So we took the bus to Walmart today and I have a little bit of footage for that and hopefully it works out and I'll show that actually before I'm saying all of this, but we took a bus to Walmart and it was a venture. The bus stop was a little hard to find, but once we got on, we were good. The figuring out where to get off was a bigger problem. But anyway, we made it to Walmart and we spent roughly, let's look, uh, 824 pesos which is roughly 41 bucks and then we paid six dollars on an uber back so it was worth it though we were getting to try some new things and have things we wanted so we have different salsa verde tostitos we have chorizo and chipotle fritos which sounded good we have pasta so we have uh, bow tie pasta we have hamburger buns some tomato sauce. I'm going to make pico. It's one of our favorites. So we have lime, jalapeno, red onion, tomato. We did not buy cilantro. It did not look good at the Walmart. Um, ketchup, ranch, and Italian dressing. I got a Lipton tea. You might recall I drank a lot of Nest tea, uh, tea in Spain and I didn't see that here. So I got a small one of those to see if I like it now. From Spain, or while we were in Spain, we drank this exact same Tinto the entire time, and we mixed it with Fanta as a Tinto de Verano, so I'm going to buy some orange Fanta and have that again. More instant mashed potatoes, a salad, garbage bags, we didn't have those. Garrett wanted squirt, so we got those. Mandarin oranges for me, apples for Garrett, rice, shredded cheese, we got postcards to send to folks, toilet paper, and I do have a frozen bag of veggies that were almost thawed, so they're in the freezer. So that's what we got for roughly 41 bucks plus six bucks on an Uber. Now, I'm not sure what we're gonna make, but at least I know I'm having some veggies. Oh, I missed showing you somewhere in here is, here we go. Um, this micro dine that you have to wash your fruit with here. So we finally found that, which is why we were able to finally get more fruits and vegetables. So we had a very exciting day. We went whale watching today. So hopefully you enjoyed that video or that segment of the video. And we went grocery shopping yet again, and we bought uh, tea. I pretty much gave up caffeine since I can't find Mountain Dew or my Monster, so I'm drinking iced tea. We got some spaghetti sauce, Diet Coke, tortillas. We're gonna make uh, tacos in Mexico because why not? Two bananas, chicken, eggs, some tomatoes. We got some Lay brand Rice Krispies eggs. We're going to cook the chicken in this salsa de chili fresco, so hopefully that's good. And we got three different types of chips, tortilla chips, and Doritos, and some salsa verde flavored Tostitos. So that's what we got for 21 bucks. Hey guys, so we went to the grocery again, surprise, surprise. We didn't leave the apartment at all yesterday uh, for two reasons. One, we felt like being lazy, and secondly, we had workers here fixing a leak in one of the rooms. So uh, they took about four days, a couple of hours each day, but that's done. And I think we're going out to dinner tonight, not sure yet, but um, if we end up eating at home, we have options now. So. We got some chicken, some steaks. They're kind of thin, but that'll be okay. Ham lunch meat, hamburger, a small thing of Philadelphia cream cheese, some sweet and salty bars, cornflakes, 
Diet Coke. Now this looks really interesting. It's salsa verde with habanero, so I, we like spicy, so hopefully that'll be good. Some apples. I mentioned in a previous grocery haul or video that I haven't had any caffeine. I needed some, so I got a, a small Coke. We have some ruffles. Garrett got some extra coffee and creamer. Two things of milk, two things of orange juice. And then the other day I bought this um, Salsa Dave Chili Fresco and it was really good. So I got that again and some shredded cheese. So in total that was 724 pesos or about 35 or 36 US. So that's what we will be eating uh, for the next few days. So we went to the grocery yet again. This time we spent 648 pesos or roughly 32 or 33 bucks. It always looks like all we get is snack food. I swear we get other stuff, but I got some Pringles. Garrett got some chili lime Fritos, so hopefully he likes those. Some Ruffles, some Doritos. We have bread, white for me, wheat or some sort of something for Garrett. Fresh veggies, that's me. Apples, that's Garrett. A couple of bananas, that's me. Peanut butter. And then tonight we are going to a friend's house to play a game. And we're bringing along Ritz and garlic and herb spreadable cheese as a snack. And two Diet Cokes for Garrett. And that's what we bought this haul. We only have about 10 more days at this Airbnb before we move on to a surprise. You'll have to stay tuned to figure out what that is. We have nine days left in our Airbnb before we move and we're trying to eat everything we have but we still need to supplement a little so we went ahead to the grocery store yet again. We paid 357, just say 358 pesos that's roughly 18 bucks for this haul, which includes toilet paper, uh, Mick Ultra for me, some white bread for me, two tomatoes, some cheese. Garrett even likes this cheese and he doesn't eat any cheese really. A salad so we can pretend we're doing good and counteracting the alcohol. Bananas for me, Cokes, Diet Coke for Garrett, and two iced teas. And that is what we have for our hopefully last or next to last grocery haul. Okay, so we are at the Rio Grande restaurant here in Puerto Vallarta, and we, or at least I, wanted Red Snapper because I love Red Snapper, and I Googled what which restaurant had the best Red Snapper, so that's why we're here. We're sitting outside, and the owner has been waiting on us. Really cool guy, or at least I think it's the owner. We have the special, um, I'll show some pictures of it, but essentially I had red snapper and shrimp, and here had red snapper and larger shrimp stuffed with cheese and wrapped in bacon. It was delicious with tip, and we each had two beers. It was about $55 US. We'll probably come back. So we just went out to eat at um, a very good restaurant. It was 15 bucks. And then we went and had one beer each on the beach. And we stopped at the OXO for some beverages at home. So Garrett got a 12 pack. I got five uh, 16 ounces. We got dessert. I got M&Ms. They're smaller than US M&Ms. Garrett got a white chocolate Snickers. And then we had to pay for a bag, and all of that came to, I think Garrett said, $13.50. Wednesday night party, baby. <laughs> So today is Super Bowl Sunday and we leave this Airbnb tomorrow to head to the Hilton in Puerto Vallarta in the hotel zone just because we need a vacation because our life is very rough. Anyway, we are running out of food and rather than go to the grocery store, we went to this chicken rotisserie place called El Puchigan. I know I'm saying that wrong, rotisserie. 
And for $9.50 we have seasoned potatoes, a whole chicken, some jalapenos, some tortilla shells, and some salsa. So that will feed us for lunch today and dinner. I hope you like this week's video. Stay tuned for next week when we wrap up our time here in Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. I hope you have a great week and don't forget to check out our blog, slowtravelchronicles.com. And as always, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, turn on the notification bell, do all of the things. It helps us out and have a great week.